hello what's up guys welcome to the new video in this video we are going to learn about the proper subset as well as the improper subset but before that we should learn about the set and the subset now what is the set it is actually the collection of the well-defined objects or the elements so here we are using the numbers it means the collection of the numbers so it is denoted by the capital letter so let's suppose here we have the A, it means the set A has the elements 2, 4 and 6. And we use the curly brackets outside the set. So it means we can say that the set A has the elements 2, 4 and 6. Now what is a subset? A set A, for example, we have the two sets A and B. A set A is a subset of set B if all the elements of set A are present in set B. So let's suppose this is the set A and this is the set B. So here we have the elements in set A, 1, 3 and 5. And in the set B we have the elements 1, 2, 3 and 5. Now you can see that all the elements of set A are present in the set B. So it means we can say that A is a subset of set B. Now here it is clear now we will learn about the proper subset as well as the improper subset now you can see that here we have the set a which has the elements 1 3 and 5 and we have the set b that has the elements 1 2 3 and 5 now you can see that this set is smaller than set b but all the elements of set a are present in set b so in that case we can say that a is the proper subset of set B. So this is the sign that is used for the proper subset and A is the proper subset of set B and this one sign is used for the subset. A is the subset of set B but it is not clear whether it is a proper subset or the improper subset. This is just the general sign used for the subset whereas this is clarifying that A is the proper subset of set B. Now we come to the improper subset. Now you can see that here we have the set D that has the elements 1, 5, 3 and 2. Now all the elements of set D are present in set B. So we can say that D is the improper subset of set B. We can also say like B is the improper subset of set D. All the elements are equal. We are not concerned about the arrangement of the elements but the elements are same and the number of elements are same so we can say that b is the improper subset of set d and we can also say like d is the improper subset of set b i hope you understand thank you for watching this video